What's up, everybody? This is Malaysia Fashions. How y'all been? Super duper excited about a lot of things that's going on right now. Today, like I said in my other video, that I will be doing um, a breakfast mukbang. I love breakfast. I can have it any time of the day. Um, yeah, what I have is strawberry waffles, bacon, and eggs. Everything well done. I have to do my thumbnail. <laughs> so, how you guys been? I'm going to start off taking the first bite because I am hungry. I've been getting... Ooh, made a little crunchy, but I like crunchy. I like crunchy. I will eat up some crunchy. I really actually reheated it, but I'm going to eat it. But I like my waffle crunchy. Well done. These are strawberry. Mm. God, I like toast. So I don't mind my waffles being quite. I don't like them soggy and soft. Mmm. Y'all like my hat? <laughs> Probably come from Malaysia Fashions. I got to say, once before, go check me out. Mmm. So most of the time you'll see me with Malaysia Fashions um products on um, whether it be the outfit or you know accessories. Mm. Like I said mm. next time I'll do um Blueberry. I love crunchy. My bacon gotta be well done. I don't want nothing half done. Medium rare, nothing. Nothing. That's why I need to invest in a, a um, air fryer. Because some stuff I be wanting crunchy. My grandma used to like her toast a little burnt. She used to like her toast burnt. I think she'll scrape off a little bit of the burnt stuff. Not too burnt. I know I gotta have my cold sprite. Didn't forgot the orange juice or the apple juice. Cause I drink. Oh, I love. I love me some apple juice. I used to drink a lot of um, orange juice. My grandma kept it at her house, and I used to drink on. Um, it was for her, and they used to have this um, brand called Big Tex. Man, the pineapple juice, the apple juice, and the orange juice was the best. And she kept it. So she was gonna make sure she had her breakfast in the morning. Whether well, it was a piece of toast and some oatmeal, or a piece of toast and some rice. She wasn't supposed to have bacon, but she, she won't sneak her a little piece of bacon up in there. Rest in peace to my grandma. I know she smiling down on me. Uh, go on but yeah, did y'all go check out that documentary? Hope you guys did. Yeah. What are y'all cooking for Thanksgiving? Drop it down below in the comments. Give me some ideas what I need to. 
ke company name is named after my daughter. I named after my daughter. My daughter is the, you know, my pride and joy. We're like this. Um, when I started, because she's so into fashion, keeping herself up, and we just came up with it one day. I'm into fashion too but my little baby like it was like she been here before she was like been here before it was like I would go out you know and when I would used to go out she would like pull out her clothes too and be like mama can I go I'm going to the club with you too I'm like no babe you got to stay here If I cry or get it, cry somewhere else, it gotta be crunchy. Like this bacon right here is hidden for. Them. I gotta be. Oh yes. He love ketchup on his eggs. How many of y'all eat ketchup on y'all eggs? All my kids are picky when it comes to food, man. And the one that actually eats seafood is my daughter. Yeah. I start eating food because of her because I will have to cook it for her. hair so silky.
now. Yeah, I have an older son that that's into animation, right? And so um, he's mixed with um, well, my baby daddy is mixed with Mexican and black, and so my son is mixed, and so he's been very artistic since um, when he was like three, four years old. I just thought he was so into Pokemon. Now he's in, well, he's been, but he's like into animation and he wants to speak Japan language. And I think it's cool. But I'm like, I need to know Spanish. Like, I need to know Spanish. So I'm like, learn Spanish for me. So you can teach me. I need to be bilingual. But yeah, it's cool. <laughs> He wants to make um, video games non-violent. So Busy, busy, busy. Busy, busy, busy. Go to work tomorrow. I don't even have to make my videos in the morning. Or when I get off of work. Man, it's hard to get up in the morning. So this is like kind of like a brunch, breakfast and lunch type of deal. Um, I want to do the breakfast tacos. Um, yeah, I really want to do that. And um, just do different variety. I'm not eating. Look, if you're coming over here wanting octopus and a gator and I'm not I'm not the, the, the girl for it. <laughs> You're gonna see what you see. Period. And y'all cook at home a lot because with this pandemic I'm just sorry. It did it, it just I'm just being very, very cautious. So you will see mostly my home cooked meals more than anything. Cause I gotta stay safe, you know. I gotta keep working, you know, stay in business. Like I can't afford to get sick. The way I'm going now, people are not washing their hands out here. Excuse me, they are not. I do event as a kitten. I did an event cause. My side is will be working events, the frat parties for the college kids. When I tell you, 
I worked at a concession stand with this other company, and this lady was not washing her hands. She was not putting on no glove, and it just it just sent me to a whole nother, you know, level of people fixing my food at the restaurants. Like, how many of y'all are still not taking this COVID serious? Like, you see people like literally like dying from this situation, and you don't want to wash your hands. And this was like an older lady. Like, why do you not want to wash your hands? And you're, you are, you can get it way quicker than, you know, because you you're an older person. So, yeah, I had a whole problem with that. I had a whole problem with that. And I just, <clears throat> some people, mm -mm. They're not taking this thing serious, man. They're not. Whether your beliefs is not, don't believe it. I mean, like, it's, yeah. <laughs> so, that's why, I'm, you know, I don't mind cooking at home. It gets time sometimes. But... Careful, man. Gotta be careful, man. No, I really got no. And then the waffle is sweet because you got the strawberry. Mm -hmm. like when ladies just like make them it's like a it's more sophisticated um thing you know I like it I really really do um yeah I'm full but yeah man give me some I some topics to talk about I be writing them down but losing the paper I need to be more organized with this thing so yeah, um, um, drop down below what kind of business you run, or, or if you're a YouTube influencer, or um, Instagram influencer, um, yeah, most definitely, I love that, I love that, I like that, how we all just, you know, trying to make things, you know, better in our life. If it means cutting people off, that's just what it is. Especially if they bring that bad energy. Huh? Let me tell you. I ain't playing no game for 20, 21. I got too much going on for myself. And then when people do stuff to you, they be feeling like they like they want everybody else to think they're innocent. No ma'am. No ma'am. Mm-mm. sleep on Dollar Tree, right? <laughs> they be really sleep on Dollar Tree. But 
have to tell y'all about Dollar Tree. Because people be really sleep on Dollar Tree and they thinking that Dollar Tree don't be having stuff. I done got from expensive. It was well, it'll be expensive in Walmart or Target. And I ain't trying to put none of the stores down because I shop at them all. But I have like a little eczema problem. Eczema is like asthma through the skin. So certain weather change, you, my skin get that thing up. Well, it's just Duracell. Dermacil, I should have bought the bottle. That stuff works. Oh man, I have not had no blotches, no nothing since I used this stuff. And then so I went back and got the cocoa butter one and the Olay, the Olay one. And man, it just puts my skin in a whole totally different level. So you know, I have to go get some more. I have to go get some more of that. Like, there's no no it's ends and buts about it. I have to go get some more of that because I go in I mean, I use jurgens too, but that works to a certain extent. But it just seems like something about that lotion is just like uh, and for a dollar? A dollar. I'm too good. Mm mm. I'm too good. I too good. This was a dollar. Then wash it. Reuse it. All day. But it's just the principle like, you know, for the makeup wipes and stuff to wipe your face or the daily wipes, you know, they got that in there. The other, they got some little Dove lotion like for your hands to keep it moisturized and keep it from being dry because I wash my hands a lot. And so it helps, you know, with my skin. Baby, you can't tell me nothing about none of that, baby. Yes, I got. I have to go because I have Bath and Body Works stuff, and my skin on it only lets me use it when it wants to let me use it. So I'm just gonna say this to say, like, yeah, it's just a whole nother different ball game. But yeah, guys, go check Dollar. If you got a Dollar Tree in your town, man, go don't sleep on Dollar Tree. You can get them little for them party for pay. Thanks instead of going to H E B, going to Walmart, paying a whole lot of money for them, and you can get it for a dollar, a dollar. That's it. That's it. Yes, go check them out. Like this lady, she was in there buying all and and um, what's that windshield wiper fluid? For a dollar, put it in a car, a brand new car. So yeah, that that that's most definitely you know a a, a good place to go for certain things. I'm not saying everything, but man, some of them stores be overpricing that stuff. So you have you know on the budget. On the budget, so that's the only thing with that. But yeah, comment down below and let me know. You know, if y'all um, shop at Dollar Tree, what what's the good things that you get out of there? You know, that I can look into into purchasing. You know, myself. But yeah, most definitely, I wants to know because. I used to go to Family Dollar and Dollar General all the time. And I still do. But it's like, I don't even really do Dollar General no more. It's not even the same. So I really do Family Dollars. But yeah. Yeah, most definitely. Most definitely. That was a good breakfast. Check me out. Like. Subscribe. Comment. Share. And come check your girl out, man. Come check me out. Come check me out.